fans only show again and uh we are back with another 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 um parts on vampire falls origins this is part seven and uh yeah a lot of things uh to discuss and talk about still questioning whether or not if i should get new armor because i have gotten new weapons i've gotten the legendary spear twin spear um does does a fuck ton of damage along with my sharp spear which does an even more amount of damage um so those two dual wielding is just absolute mayhem um so those sign the book quests i did basically all of them as you can see that we are level 20 here we gr I grinded up quite a bit um pretty extremely high leveled um yeah i've almost maxed out all of these you know i got hard hitter um vitality is up i unlock this um we have a fuck ton of quests to complete so many you have no idea i was really busy offline um we've gotten a new ability we're about to unlock petrify we've unlocked fortify we've maxed out bite uh, we have another which is called magus which if we activate i can choose which elemental i want to be when i um when i use conjure so it won't just be dark damage. I can make it lightning damage or fire damage or any types of damage, basically. Um, um, also, uh, we've just explored a fuck ton of the map as well. Um, I've done a, a lot of quests, a lot of quests. We've explored all the way over here, down here, all over here. There's a lot of quests over here that I still need to complete. So. Um, yeah, so I still got one more sign in the book. Uh, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to head over here to see what this was about. And then uh, we'll probably head over to the next area. Um, so we're pretty powerful in terms of strength. I probably take down a few heads. Before I go there, actually, we need to go to this lonely man's tavern. Um, so that way we can, whatchamacallit, uh, be able to craft some items. I do need some health potions, some travel potions, and uh, all that stuff. Uh, so, he's, yeah, as you can see, we're doing like 60 plus, 50 plus damage, just high amounts of damage. Um, basically, unkillable. Uh, we can take down even the strongest of guards. I'm going to use Bite, and I'm going to use Thrust. So yeah, our bite does a lot of damage and heals us up for even more. So that's going to be my bread and brother to keep me alive through this game. My bread and butter tactic. Uh, I think we got like two more episodes before I re do a re-LP re on this. Um, I'll be dropping Heroes and Castles 2 Part 3 uh, tomorrow. Maybe even a little bit after I drop this video, but... um. Let's go ahead. We got a church visitor. The church, it must be offended. Overrun by darkness. Retake it. Uh, well, I got other things to do. Not entirely uh, in fighting condition. But you know what? We are going to mark this place on the map. And uh, we're going to head off to that lonely man's tavern. So we can allow ourselves to craft. Because it is extremely necessary. As long as you stay on the road, you shouldn't run into any type of difficulties or anything like that. Um, oh. I guess we can do those. Um, take that. Take that. And then we'll take one of those all right pretty stocked up um this place doesn't have a uh, apparently this place doesn't have no type of healer kind of disappointed in that 
Um, so let's go ahead and head back off into that one little quest, see what that was all about. And then uh, this guy right there is an extreme boss fight. This guy's extremely strong. He'll kill you in like one hit. There's also another guy like right around here in this area that'll kill you in like another one hit. You'll get slaughtered basically. If I can remember, I moved the marker, so hopefully I can remember where that shit was at. Um, but it was somewhere over here. Okay, let me change my marker to right here. We're going to get that last book signed. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and overrun the darkness. Alright, so I probably got to kill something, a church spirit. Well, I didn't realize he was going to be this fucking powerful. We're definitely going to have to take the L for that. There's no way in hell I'm winning that fight. I am sorry. That shit is not happening. Yeah, okay, that guy would have murdered me. To put it quite simply. I do need to grind up. I need better armor, like ASAP, so I'm going to be spending a little bit of gold once I grab some more. Um, I think I'm going to complete like two two or three quests, and then uh, I'll end this episode off with buying armor. Probably the best thing I can do. Um, as long as you stay on the road, you should be safe. Enemies really can't harm you on the road. It's like a safe haven. But the minute you stray off, enemies will just run your shit. Um, there was a guy... He was an adventurer killer. He was like somewhere right over here. And I killed his ass <laughs> offline. Of course, I did a lot of things offline um, for this and Heroes in Castles too as well. I did a lot of things offline for that, uh, but I'll show you off when I get that episode dropped. <coughs> oh man, I'm feeling pretty sick, but all right. So yeah. A lot of piercing damage. I'll make sure that my next uh, playthrough, I'll do slashing damage with a, um, a mage. See how that works. Uh, this heavy thrust is extremely powerful, as you're about to find out. Damn, you took 175 health points. That is bread and butter, baby. Alrighty, so we're probably going to have to go back to our hometown vampire and I want to see if I can defeat that other dark spirit. I should be strong enough. I'm probably going to have to get more, um, fuck, get more, uh, fuck, I forgot what I'm going to have to get, but I'm going to have to get some shit, some armor, get some better armor. Alright, I guess we're loading. Awkward. The fuck? <laughs> Longest load in the world. A dark forest spirit. Shouldn't be too hard to kill. Boop. Ooh, that was pretty good. Let's go with Conjure. Lightning. It's not bad. It's not bad, not bad. We won't be using Conjure at all, really. It's kind of a weak move. You'd be using Backstab if I use any of my Conjure abilities. Um, this place looks pretty sore the fuck up. There's blood everywhere. I would see if there's a treasure chest, but I'm not in the mood to get killed by one of these floating spirits that be hanging around here. So I'm gonna drink that. Alrighty, so we completed the quest. That quest in particular. Um... 
see what other things that we can do. So we would have to go all the way back for the whole sign to... Yeah, but we're not doing that. <clears throat> uh, we got some lieutenants to kill. The guy is actually pretty strong. I'm not sure I can beat him. But, um... Fuck. It'd be even, it'd be even farther... If I teleported to Avon and try to walk there, so I'm just gonna have to bust the move here. And just try to walk it. Fuck it. We don't have time to be dealing with all these battles. I'll be trying to flee more often now. Combat in this game, it does get a little eh. It gets ish after a while. So you want to search around these because you will find treasure chests. Um, so hopefully I can find one. I got some gold in it. Yeah, I'm not even going to do it. Fuck it. I'll do it later. Okay. I'll take 100 gold. Where is this farmer I'm supposed to be? Pretty shady ass quest. Let me see that again. fuck is Mark of the Farmer? I've never met this guy in my life. Oh, he's right here. <laughs> what the fuck? Why would he be hanging out so damn close to an enemy? Probably got on the other side of the road. That jerk, you know. But I'll give you 110 gold. Okay. Okay, okay. Beat Mark. Beat Mark the Farmer. Or beat Chris the farm. I'm gonna fuck Chris up for that 110 gold, son. I need the money. I, I'm sorry, bro. I, I gotta, I gotta kill you, bro. You, I'm sorry, bro. No hard feelings. This is just how it has to go. Everybody's gotta die someday, my friends. Fortunately, your time is now. All right, let's go with some conjure. That'll be good enough. And the lightning damage is kind of weak. It's not even worth the effort of using it anymore. Start using my bite mechanic because everything else just seems to not favor myself. I don't know what I was trying to say, but uh, yeah. Chris the Farmer, you're still alive. After I just got through stabbing your ass up. You are a good person. Don't fucking feel like one. <laughs> just beat up a random farmer for 110 gold. I don't feel very good about that. Who the fuck are you? I can find this ring. So called. Alright, let's head back on a path here. I just realized that I'm getting way too deep into this game. To be doing a whole different new playthrough. But, uh, fuck it. Uh, we do it anyways. Shit. Alright, so I just gotta fight one of these guys in here. Ah, uh, this guy is pretty powerful. He has that attack that just does multiple damage. I'm going to try to see if I can uh, somehow bite him twice. Oh, yeah. Dodge all them shits. 
Oh, we got me back. Okay, we're gonna go with two bites here. So I've gained my focus all the way up to 102, so we can basically hax ourselves. Oh yeah. Okay, so boom. Ooh, that's a lot of piercing damage, yo. Stop dodging, please. Oh my god, the damage is real. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. Keep that tempo. Keep that tempo. We might be able to make this out. Ah, uh, shit. Oh my god. We have barely survived. That is crazy as fuck. He had us on the brink. He gave me a run for my fucking money. I can't even imagine what the third lieutenant is like. It's kind of scary. Lesser piercing ring, huh? I do like piercing rings. Piercing damage. I'm going to get some more of that. And uh, sell some of the shit that I got on me. Um, I need to go to a store. Um, some type of village. Let's go drink. Let's go to Crom and Guard here. So many quests. Not even nearly enough time to complete even a percentage of them. Alrighty, that's a lot of experience points. Uh, okay, let me see what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna upgrade my max HP for sure, bro. That shit is ridiculous. Let's get some armor going, a little bit of more focus. Uh, as in for ability points, um, I really don't know. Alright, I'll just go with the Sharpen. We can start using that ability more often now. Since it is actually pretty resourceful. Um, somehow I ended up on the other side of that wall. Oh, this is Mariana. She, She's not the person I want to see. We selling all that shit. And uh, while we're here, I'm going to go ahead and take another one of those. Pop another one of those. And uh, yeah. Yeah, the barriers in this game are pathetically placed, if I do say so myself. No, we're going to focus on armor here. That's the problem with me getting killed so quickly. Um, that gives me 32 armor.
I don't know what the fuck to buy. That's the problem with buying armor. Alright, I'll buy those for like that much. That feels much better. I feel actually safe to actually enter combat. Um, let me see. Where should I? I'm gonna go to Avon. Handle some business, bitches. Go ahead, craft my last one, let's take off here, next episode I'll probably upgrade my uh, seconds, both of my spears hopefully, um, but yeah we're going to go back to our main town here, see if I could beat that spirit that I couldn't beat before, I'm interested to see what happens when you win one of those fights, um, I did say I was going to end the episode with me buying armor, but I'd rather just uh, kill this demon real quick and then end the episode there. As soon as the game starts lagging on some jank jank. <laughs> some janky jank. Alrighty. Let's keep going. So I got a new recording system, new audio system. So it should some of my gameplay videos should sound better. Um, we got my PlayStation 1 fixed, and I did not know that there was rain in this game. It's a rare element that rarely happens, but alright. Okay, somewhere over here. Let me see this. Somebody's house right there. Let's go ahead and get this treasure chest I neglected to get earlier. Let's fight. All right, so I want to see if I can beat this guy. I feel like I can. If he doesn't dodge too much, I should be able to um, get bites off. Then let's go to thrust. Not bad, not bad. I got confidence I can probably kill this guy. Oh, uh, he has that regen. I did forget about that. All right, we got to make sure that we do twice as much damage to him then. Because this is not going to end well. Go ahead and bite. Let's get some of our own regen. Let's hit him with that dual attack again. We need to stay lowering his health. All right, motherfucker, get hit with a heavy thrust. Uh, right to the ball sack. If spirits had ball sacks, I'd be kind of confused. <laughs> How the fuck did those get there? <laughs> Were they that heavy? <laughs> you still had to take them with you. Uh, that was a lot of experience points and a fuck ton of gold. And we have gotten some good pickups. Interesting. So that's all it does. It just gives you good items. This is 22 armor, slashing resistance, focus regen. I'll take that increase in armor. Um, uh, let me see something. I still have yet to figure out how to get to this one. I know I have to go all the way from this side downwards. But I really don't want to do that shit. Um, 
So, yet to discover this half of this town. Um, okay, we're going to do this just business and then we'll end this episode. A Vampire Fall Origins. I am not finna walk back there. I should have saved that for Common Guard, because that trip is extremely long. But uh, fuck it. That's just a trip I can do offline. Um, but before we do anything, we need to go to our uh, our little buddy over here. I mean, I can always just buy potions, so I'm not too worried about what happens with them. Thank you. So I think we know where Vaso's son is. He's, he's somewhere over here. In some area over there. Um, but not to worry. We will try to kill him eventually. I found him earlier, but he was just way too powerful for me. He killed me in like one one axe throw. I said, okay, okay, fuck this shit. <laughs> you win, bro. I'm not taking that L like that. I'm here for you, brody. I'm here to take that ass. Or your life, either one. Comes first. And it's a swamp dealer. He's a wizard, so we're going to have to play offensive as fuck. That attack is about to hurt. So I'm about to fortify. And it still did a lot of damage. Okay, let's sharpen up. And then uh, go ahead and hit him with a thrust. Boop. Boop. Fuck you, die. Bastard. Uh. <laughs> okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you guys have... I will see you guys next time when we come back with uh, more Vampire Falls Origins. We got the Cursed Church over here. We got one of these quests that we got to kill a demon over there. Um, Avon's son is over here. We have another one of those fights down here. And then, of course, we have these couple quests over here. So I'll see you guys next time, and we'll go ahead and tackle those. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys have, make sure to like, subscribe, give us some feedback. And as always, fans, until next time, Bye bye